the toss once again so important in these matters and it was Dravid who was lucky with the toss again and he elected to once again bowl first so India will be chasing for the final time to a formula that has been a winning one for India the two teams were announced well India they're resting Tendulkar and Irfan Patan they've got uh, Ramesh Pawar back in and so is Zahir Khan in the team with uh, Murli Karthik as the super sub Pakistan have dropped Salman but the opener his place taken by Imran Farad and if the car Rao Anjum comes in place of Rana Navi then Faisal Iqbal has been appointed as the super sub for Pakistan Karan Akmal opening the batting for Pakistan and here is Zahir Khan doesn't look as if it's going to be a tentative start by Pakistan this time Wakar Lofted just over his head, that will go all the way. Edged and threw the slip cord on for four. That hurts bowlers. Through the gap again. I think it will go all the way. It's a long chase. But it gets there. That will go all the way. I think that's leg buys. Will wait on umpire Aleem Dar, it is. That's put away in the air. Kamran Akmal will eventually get a four. India. This will be taken. What a good ball. Great thinking from Sri Shant. Finally, he had the better of the batsmen. Managed to get Imran Farad. He was sort of running away from them. Bouncer that came onto him much quicker than he imagined very well done indeed that's the breakthrough required and he likes it in the air will this be taken it's gone high in the air it's a sky and well held rp singh didn't panic kamran akmal did two down now pakistan wide of the crease and he's gone they picked up the big wicket Shoaib Malik has got plenty of runs against India and great delivery. I mentioned great because just keep your eyes on the usage of the crease as a bowler. As Shiva said, use the crease beautifully. Well, he was expecting the ball come, ball come at him or into him. That one just pitched and left him. Smart bowling. Very clever. That should go. Not the right line that from Zahir Khan. Well, he has gone for it, Inzi. And we know he's a powerful man. He did hit the bottom and he gets the ah! Big shout. And he's given. That was a straight delivery. Well, what a time to get your first ODI wicket. Match number four in Zamamul Haq. You've just been hit for a six. Talk about comebacks. Flatter trajectory. Inzamam trying to paddle it fine. And it hits him in line. That's what he had to decide. Steve Buckner did it hit in line or outside. I think he's got that pretty much there. In the air, in the gap. Four. It's a boundary. A little bit of width and what a shot. Glorious shot from Ahmad Yusuf. Beautifully done. Wonderfully placed. Played it late. Played it fine. Got four for it. That's lofted. Will it go all the way? Caught. They needed that wicket, India. And that's not what Pakistan needed for sure. Yes, they certainly needed that wicket. They needed to break this partnership all of 95 already. Mohammad Yusuf gone for a splendid 67. Pakistan 210 for five. Oh, don't worry about it. It's gone many a mile. He is a dangerous player when he gets going. The crowd's loving it. And that's asking for trouble. Abdul Razak realized it and he picks up yet another boundary. It's in the air. Midwicket is getting underneath it. 
and he takes it quite easily. Good bowling. The length was on the shorter side. Young man is RP Singh, but he's provided the much needed breakthrough for the Indians. Abdul Razak goes for 24, Pakistan 239 for 6. And he's knocked him over. Terrific comeback in his last spell, Zahir Khan. In the right areas and now reaping rewards, picking up his first wicket. And he just came out with an excellent slow delivery. Nowhere near to the bat and knocked his leg stump. The goes for 10, Pakistan 261 for 7. Srishant again. He wants to. Dolly can't get Sida. Mohamed Kaif, the fielder. The Indian part of the crowd is extremely happy, and Srishant, boy, he's having a wonderful outing here. Well, another low full toss, very difficult to hit, trying to go over the top of that cover fielder but uh, Mohammed Kaf very smart catch easy catch Mohammed Sami goes for two well he's taken the aerial route this time and it's gone all the way the first time he's tried it Yunus Khan has been successful and this time straight up but there's a man underneath it he will be a mere spectator consecutive maximums for Yunus Khan. <laughs> a bit of excitement from the crowd, just the single. He's moved on to 74, Yunus Khan. After the 38th over, he hadn't picked up a single boundary till this one. Is this a good total? Two more deliveries. We'll look for two. And get it quite easily in the end. We'll just get the single raw with the car. So Pakistan after 50 overs have reached 286 for eight. Well, familiar problem for Pakistan. They're four down for 115, three down for 77. So the top order has been very fragile indeed in the series. A recovery of some sort from Mohamed Yusuf, 67 of 85. And Yunus Khan remained unbeaten on 74 of 79. And that last over when 18 runs were scored could be the turning point of the game if India do not get to the target. Well, that's a flashing drive through the offside. Gautam Gambhir will not run a great deal. Some swing and well, better swing from the bat of Rahul Dravid. Down the track and it's a good hit. Good positive shot from Gotham Gambhir. Just over his head. Just got enough bat on the ball to power it over that point. Piercing that offside field again. Well, he has got him this time, I think. Yes. Steve Butler took a bit of time to give him out. But this time, he's gone. Gautam Gambhir goes for 38. India 69 for one. Well, that's a glorious drive from Yuvraj Singh. And that has quietened the audience here. That's a good shot. No need to run for those. Found the gap again. All he has to do is drift to that off stump line and he'll be punished. Well, the misfield brings up Dravid's 50. The captain's having a good tour. 68 won the international 50 for Rahul Dravid. And gone. Is he? Yes, the Indian captain has to take the long walk to the pavilion. Well thought delivery, a slower delivery. Went through with the shot, no control. And mid off fielder has no problem. Shoya Malik there, easy catch. The captain goes for 50. 
will be runs and it will be four of them and he's found the gap and we all know how hard he can hit the cricket ball by interesting Dhoni that's hit hard for a four what a shot in the gap mid on was up in the ring that's a very good stroke Shreb Malik is quickly across oh he lets it go would you believe it Fine leg inside the circle. Very delicately and nicely played. In the air, catch it is the call. Oh, the fielder was in two minds. Should I go for the catch? Should I stop the runs? He does neither. Mohammad Sami. Again. Fine leg inside the circle. We saw the lesser experienced Yasser Arafat making a mistake. They're giving, they have given two boundaries in the last over and two boundaries in this over. And that's what India requires. India requires one boundary in an over. And if they get one boundary in an over, they're home. They have no problem. Finds the gap. Brings up his sixth one day international hundred. Yuvraj Singh has played a scintillating knock and has come of age. Well, not only the 100, the best thing about him is the way he played and the time he played. And look at this, all flaws coming from the, from the dressing room. He's gone over the top and when he does that, he will clear the boundary ropes quite easily. So Dhoni starting to open up for India. Tie the free the and going for the north strikers in the throw. Gautam Dumbi running for Yudraj Singh. Misfield could be more runs. Can he cut that out? Oh, five runs. It's all going in India's way. A little bit of panic in the Pakistan camp. Sixth one day international 50 for Mahindra Singh Dhoni. What a player he is. A delight to watch. He will not look at the bowler. He'll just look at the ball. And if it's there to be smashed, he'll do exactly that. Straight down the ground. And don't bother. Just fetch it. There was a long on and a long off, but they were mere spectators. Be a chance no it isn't but exactly now we know what his plans are if he plays 15 balls then there is trouble for the opposition Dhoni oh cracking shot ends the over with a boundary again taken the aerial route and no guessing where it's landed no worry but no mercy there for the bowler. And again. He is sensational. Truly sensational. Well, what can one say? This man is just awesome. Look at that. On the back foot. And he just swung this heavy bat. And that one went miles high and far one run needed and cheeky moves to 77 and india have won this match it's been a great team effort plenty of youngsters coming into the indian team for the one day tournament it's a big margin the hutch cup five one day internationals india winning the series 4-1 and aren't they happy? We've done it again. This duo of Yuvraj Singh and Mahindra Singh Dhoni. Great partnership. That's all in their home. The man of the series was Yuvraj Singh for his consistent batting display. And Rahul Dravid, the happy captain, winning the series 4-1. Oh, what a wonderful performance by India. They've become master chasers. And again, the finishers were at it. Yuvraj Singh not out 107 of 93 balls. His batting on this trip has been flawless. And Mahendra Singh Dhoni, 77 of 56, once again bludgeoning the bowlers into submission.